So it's been a little bit since I last posted, but I made a greenhouse, greenhouse on wheels. And nice little windows on top. I gotta put some Velcro there on the side or something or a zipper. But most times I just put a piece of wood to hold the plastic down. That can hold that up. Chappelle. Now why you might ask why would I build it on wheels? Well, as you can tell this would be a huge pain in the butt to water because it's not something you can walk in. So you have all your ceilings in there. I mean you can check them, you can raise the windows if it's getting too warm or whatever, hot day. So when you go to water them, just blow it out of the way. Walk over your ceilings, you know, water them, and then push it back. Came up with a little idea. Little idea. Hand cart tires I got off of Amazon. And then I just used a bolt. And then uh, a lock nut on the end. Washers to fill the space. Um, I got a diagonal this way from it keep it from moving you know shifting one way or the other and I got this brace on the end to shift keep from shifting this way for the most part pretty sturdy <laughs> the wood was still kind of wet yeah, I'm thinking probably like 18 20 percent but I mean, it's holding up and how I built this probably show you best here so how I built this is I built think of uh, like building a house you build all the walls first I would build like this wall like I'd I would have this end and these two boards and of course all the sections in between the whole length like I'd build this wall then you know from here to here build that section build that section you know build each section and then I put each of the sections together and I screwed you know from one board into the next and I also have these little pieces that I cut out now it took me a little bit to get the angles but I finally did get them so I got that cut out and I'm trying to think what else oh I use these strips because it's better holding plastic down because if you use just single staples more it's more likely to rip but if you have a whole strip you have tension all the way down there and it's less likely to less likely to rip and we had some pretty windy days and uh I did build another greenhouse I'll have to show you that one that one was a quick one but this one I took a lot of time I mean it takes a ton of time notching this out um, I basically used the table saw to cut you know this vertically one and then I just had the hand saw or the circular saw to cut this knot or this way table saw this way circular saw this way I just notched the 2x4 out because it was going to be a little tricky to keep using um, basically 1x3s because I got rough cut lumber that 1x6s and then I just basically yeah most of this stuff is just made out of all 1x6s but I ripped the 1x6s in half so these are mostly 1x3s I didn't plane them or nothing I just pretty much just sent it turned out pretty good and it's made out of hemlock so it should last pretty good wow anyways but yeah that's my greenhouse my huge time sink of a greenhouse but pretty cool i'm happy with it